Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Eno. In today's video, we'll be looking at how to install an Apache web server on an Ubuntu machine. I'm at the terminal and the first command we'll need is for updating the uh, system repositories and the command is sudo apt update and that should update the uh, repositories. Then the next command is to do the actual installation. sudo up install Apache 2. Now mine is already installed and it's saying that it's already at the latest version. The next thing to do is to check the status of the web server and the command will be sudo system ctl status Apache 2. And as we can see from the output, it's uh, active, running, and it's also enabled. Now we'll, we'll need to enable the uh, this web server on the UFW firewall. And before we can do that, we'll need to check to see which profiles are configured uh, within UFW. And to do that, we'll navigate to the folder where that we can view those uh, profiles. So we'll change to that directory, etc UFW application D. We'll list the contents here. And this is the file. So we'll use the cut command to view it. Cut. Details. We have three profiles here, Apache, Apache Secure, Apache Full, and this one has the ports 80 and 443 for HTTP. So we'll use Apache Full to allow Apache on the uh, UFW firewall. The command for doing that would be this, uh, CD back, and then we'll use UFW allow now uh, we'll do Apache full. And it says it's been added. So we'll check the firewall status. So the UFW status. And it's listed under here as being allowed from anywhere. So that finishes the configuration for the firewall. Now we can check, we can verify to see if, uh, if this uh, web server is uh, accessible. And there's two ways to do it. We can use a text-based browser, or we can use a, like a regular browser like uh, Firefox and Chrome. Now the text-based browser is called eLinks. We can install it. Um, We'll do sudo apt install eLinks. Again, this one is already installed on my uh, computer here. We'll go ahead and uh, use it to uh, access the web, web server. The command is eLinks http colon forward slash forward slash localhost. And as you can see here, we have access to the web server. Use Q to exit. We can open Firefox as well. And we can go to the same link. HTTP colon forward slash forward slash localhost. And it's telling us that this is the default page for the Web, Apache 2 web server. So that verifies that it's it's working. Now we can also access this web server remotely from a different machine or different computer. For instance, I have a Windows computer here and I have the uh, Chrome browser open. I can access this web server if I need the address, the IP address. So I'll check it here. The IP address for this computer, it's uh, 172.16.1.100. So I'll open the web browser from my local machine or different computer and then access this remotely. So let me go ahead and open that browser and put in that IP address. 
0.72.16.100 and as you can see it's taking me to the uh, same page that we got before so that's all for this video i hope this information has been useful i'll see you again in my next video thanks bye